Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. I know I sure am. So today we're gonna to be doing something just a little bit scary for me, and that's gonna be unboxing a brand new guitar. Now you might be asking yourself like, what do you mean that's scary? That's supposed to be super exciting and awesome and fun, and I agree with you. Unboxing new equipment is always a great feeling, right? And it's always exciting. Except that every time I've made a video with an unboxing, the equipment inside has been broken. And that has happened not once, not twice, not three times, but four times. <laughs> and it all started with a Harley Benton CST, which was one of my first videos. Then it was a suit pedal, then it was the replacement for the Harley Benton CST. And then the, it was for a video that I never actually released, which was for an Ibanez GRG Geo guitar. So at that point, about two years and a half ago, I said, no more unboxing videos of this channel. There's a curse. It just doesn't make sense. Um, and I haven't made one in um, almost three years, I think now, or two years and a half. And you know what? Things change, time flies by. I'm in a different place now, so I'm optimistic that I've broken the curse, or I hope so. <laughs> kind of terrified right now. I haven't opened this, so we're about to find out. Let's just get to the unboxing now. All right, guys. I'm a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie, but here she is. This is an Indio guitar. In fact, for some of you that have seen some of my older videos, this will be familiar. All right, got my trusty knife in here. Let's go ahead and unbox this. It came off easy. Man, this was barely taped in. All right, so far, smooth sailing. Okay. All right, that looks all correct. Maybe around here. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Let's uh, flip it around and lift the top off. There we go. All right. So this is a brand new Indio Deluxe Cali, and the first thing we're gonna see is that it comes with a gig bag, and. It's actually a really nice gig bag. I mean, this is not some of the uh, nylon covers that the more affordable guitars come with. Before I open the guitar up, let's see what else we got. We got a cable right here. And we've got an Indio user's manual. Great. Doesn't seem like there's anything else. No? Let me check the pockets. Should be maybe adjustment tools. No, interesting, okay. So there's nothing in the pockets, nothing outside the cable in the box. The moment of truth. <laughs> Please don't be broken. I'm gonna be heartbroken if you are. Okay, so there's um, extra padding uh, on the guitar. And here are the tools, by the way. So there we go. Let's see what we got here. Oh geez, I just saw the, uh, this area right here looks like scuffed. <laughs> Can you tell I'm nervous about this? I shouldn't be, but. Okay, so we got one tremolo bar, one, two, three, four adjustment tools. Nice. All right, the moment of truth. <laughs> okay. You gotta be kidding me. I'm, I'm telling you, it's not me. This channel is cursed for unboxings. The headstock is chipped off. Jesus. Sorry guys, that is it for me. I'm never doing an unboxing video, so enjoy this one while it lasts, because it's just not happening ever again. <laughs> that is wild. And that is beautiful, by the way. Look at that back. Wow. Man, it's such a shame. That sucks so much. All right, let's see the front. You guys are seeing this with me, by the way. Yeah, this is very interesting. So this is different. This is supposed to be the same guitar that I reviewed on the channel a couple of years ago, but this is actually, this looks different. All right, so first impressions, outside of that <laughs> nasty headstock chip, which is only there because I decided to unbox the guitar in the channel. Um, it looks really, really attractive, really great. These are supposed to come set up from the uh, 
Monoprice, um, I don't know, headquarters or st store or whatever factory. <laughs> and hold on, let me take this off. Okay. Yeah, it's not exactly in tune. Yeah. Action's not bad. It needs to be tuned. Um, let's let's put it through its paces and do a little sound demo. All right, guys. So you just saw the uh, very depressing unboxing. <laughs> now we're gonna get into some sound demos. So I haven't done anything to the guitar outside of tune it up. Um, so I'm going to uh, play something over a clean loop with both clean and distorted tones, and then go from there. <laughs> So you just heard me going through some clean tones and dirty tones through a clean loop that I just did. Um, so let me give you some specifications first for the guitar and then I'll go over my uh, final thoughts. So um, this guitar is made with a basswood body with a quilt at top, but in my particular instrument, it just looks more like a natural finish. Either way, I think it looks great. Um, it's just that I recall the prior um, Indio Cali Deluxe Strat that I had reviewed had like a very quilted like tiger stripe kind of finish So this is a little bit different, but I think I still think it looks great. We got three single quilt pickups We got a Wil Wilkinson VS 50 uh, One volume two tone pods five wave precision selector switch. We've got 22 medium frets um, We've got a very comfortable C shape. We got a headstock Yeah um, we got string threes, uh, we got some standard die cast tuners, um, and a very beautiful um, natural back. Um, so yeah, so the guitar is claimed to be set up, so now I'm going to use kind of like my thoughts about everything. So the guitar is claimed to be set up, um, and I would tell you that the action is really great, actually, you know, the string height, um, I don't think you'll be able to see that from the camera, but it's uh, very low. Uh, which is great with not a lot of buzzing. Um, thought being said, uh, the intonation is slightly off. I don't know if you were able to notice that in my playing, but not a lot. 
Obviously the trim bar needs proper adjustment because I used it a little bit and it, it went out a little bit out of tune. Um, so this guitar, it usually retails for about $198, like 200 bucks. So basically like 190 or 189, I think, something like that. Um, I got it on sale because they had a sale right now. I think they still do with 20% less for about $155. And honestly, for that price, you know, shipped to your door, free shipping. It got here, I think in about a week. Um, it's really great value, especially when you can see that you get like a really nice kickback out of it. You have a guitar with a really good tremolo once properly set up. Um, it looks great, it plays great. The last time that I, I did a review on this exact guitar or um, guitar type, um, the major complaint that I had was that the pickups, the single coil pickups were very low output. Um, but it feels like they've changed those or maybe they've made some adjustments to those because these are definitely a lot more output than those. I think those, if I were to have measured them, would probably have been like 5K or less. I'm not joking. Um, where these, I, you know, maybe I should have measured them, but they're probably around like seven or eight, quite, quite high output for single coil. So that's a very nice welcome change that I've seen. Um, I wanted to do this video because even though I did do a video a couple of years ago about this guitar, um, number one is I bought that one as a used open box instrument. So there were some problems with it. Like I said, I had a, a very hard time setting it up because it had some fret sprout, uneven frets, um, fret edges were sharp. Not the case this time, fret edges are smooth. Um, fret level seems to be pretty decent. Um, action is set up pretty good outside the box. So I'm very impressed with that. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to do that video because of that. And because I noted that no one else has done a, a video about these. So it's kind of wild two years later, normally I do a video and then I see a couple pop up, but no one did that. And it's honestly, it's a really great Strat guitar for that money. I mean, the, the uh, tremolo alone will probably set you off to about a third of the price of the instrument. And it looks great. It plays great. Um, yeah, it has a chipped off headstock, but that's just me when I do unboxing videos. So you shouldn't have to worry about that. Anyways, I'll obviously have to uh, contact Monoprice to uh, set up a return. Um, but yeah, for the money, you know, quality gig back, quality guitar, um, really can't go wrong. So that's been it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I've been rough. If you did enjoy the video, please give me a like, subscribe, comment, do all that basic YouTube jazz, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Have a great day and take care.